Gene therapy sounds a little bit scary. Yeah, exactly. So instead of thinking this like a gene therapy, because that word has a lot of connotations behind it, just think of it as a delivery system to increase your follistatin levels back to when you were younger. And follistatin is a naturally occurring peptide in your body. And as you get older, the levels decrease, just like many peptides in your body do. Mm -hmm. So we're just restoring something back to a normal level. And why follistatin? Yeah. There's, there's many reasons. Number one is very safe. So that was probably the biggest reason why our team chose to make that the first target. Even if you overdose on follistatin, it's not going to do anything. It's, it's meaning it's going to just saturate the receptors and there's no real side effects from that. The worst case scenario is it doesn't work uh, because there, it's been around for over 20 years. It's not a new molecule. Uh, it's been discovered for a long time, but the, the kind of the breakthrough was to get it to stay in your system because follistatin as a peptide has a half-life of 90 minutes. Oh, okay. So the peptides that you can like, if you Google follistatin, yeah, and you can buy it off like up. anywhere, but you'd have to inject yourself like 10 times a day and wake up in the middle of the night oh, for you to, okay. to keep your level steady. And that's obviously not practical. Mm -hmm. So that's why no one really prescribes follistatin and no one really uses the online ones because the half-life is just way too short.